Hey everyone, my name is Bavin. Welcome to Pokelosophy, where we talk about life, health, and philosophy through the original games of Pokemon, my introspective teaching tool. It's been a bit. Uh, I had a weird thing that happened on my YouTube where I lost, well, not weird. I lost a few subscribers and I actually felt pretty bad. I, I know in the last video I talked about, I've been busy fighting my own battles and I, you know, I just felt this like weird, um, I guess I was sad because I feel like I failed some of these subscribers. Like this is the most subscribers I've lost in a single point of time. And in a world that we're living in right now with like all these issues, we all need to basically help each other as best we can. And I feel like I wasn't helping you by providing content or whatever it may be. So to those, those subscribers who find me again and see this video, I just want to say I apologize. As I said in my last video, I am busy with stuff and I've been trying to incorporate, you know, video cameras into my gameplay and I'm not going to be doing that uh, at least for this year because I do want to have a faster turnaround time for videos when I do have a chance to make these videos because I still have a commitment to finish the, at least Pokemon Red in the Poke Philosophy kind of manner which I have in the description that you can take a read at. So to subscribers that unfollowed me, uh, I understand and I hope you can come back and revisit my channel when... I, you're more interested in it because again I, I totally get it and it's m me not upholding my end of the bargain with that said we're gonna go fight koga and like every gym battle we always use a sun Tzu quote and we're gonna use this quote here he will win who prepared himself ways to take the enemy unprepared and i'm using the same lineup i used for a sabrina this is my little ai generated <laughs> image put a little Jolty on there and we're gonna go blitzkrieg again we're gonna go fast and we're gonna attack hard i'm beginning to understand why people face koga before they face sabrina when i was going through the trainers in the gym koga felt a lot easier so anyways we're gonna go ahead let's do a quick demonstration of the lineup so you have parasect jolteon raichu dugtrio but butterfree and pidgeotto it's my blitzkrieg lineup fast attacking um and speed up my play or at my disposal. Let's do this. It's a long awaited battle. And it's, it's actually the halfway point in the game, which is really neat. And I think going into the safari zone, which I'll talk about later, it's actually it's quite symbolic on where I am in my life right now. Oh wait, it took the wrong one. Do, 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 do. I love I love this beat. Okay, let's go. Let's save the game first before we do anything stupid. Let's do it. A mere child like you dares to challenge me? Very well, I shall show you true terror as a ninja master. You shall feel the despair of poison and sleep techniques. Hey, wait, I have Parasite, this is gonna be easy. Let's go. Four Pokemon, okay. Coffin. Oh, this is easy. Well, that was easy. This is what I was trying to do. Make the Pokemon sleep, send in Jolteon. It didn't work so well in the last uh, battle. But I like speed. Well, he's still sleeping, so let's increase double team. We can do it six times. Oh, wake, woke up. Okay, let's go, let's go. Nice, well done. Muck, okay, let's do it again. Yes, let's put in Parasect. Ugh. 39, oh man. Well, no problem. We'll just use. That uh, doesn't. I'm not worried about that. Mwahaha. Let's change Pokemon. Let's use Raichu. Haha. <laughs> 
<laughs> this strategy is so good. Let's use Thunderbolt. This is the first time I've ever had Raichu in my lineup. I always kept the Pikachu because I'm kind of sentimental that way. I like Raichu. Raichu is dope. Let's do Mega Kick. Nice and easy, right? I'm, I'm not even feeling that fast right now. I feel actually quite... Uh, let's, put, let's put Parasect back in. He has two coughings? What? That's weird. And done. Easy peasy. I love Spore's 100% effectiveness rate. So good. If you're wondering why this one used Parasect, I want to have fun, right? Like, this is, like, good practice for any sort of Pokemon switching or, like, dual team strategy. And I think this is important to practice anytime you get. I'm not challenged. I have Parasect Strength at my disposal at any time, so I'm not worried. And this is about me helping the entire team uh, build a Blitzkrieg strategy, which I'll use in maybe potential other gym battles and other uh, against other Pokemon traders in the future. But because I, I do want to refine this strategy as much as I can. Might be the most boring Pokemon battle I've done. It just shows you I prepared so much for Sabrina that Ka Koga is like a joke. And the double team. Nice. Let's leave Jolteon in for this one, just for the sake of the entertainment of this channel. <laughs> Wheezing! No. Let's see what I can do with this. Uh, Thunders. Oh, the world 43, whoa. Can't, missed. I'm just too fast. Oh, he got me with Smog. Oh, oh ba barely did anything. Okay, we'll use, quick, we'll use quick attack. Oh, I forgot to... Uh, do I have any items? No, it's, it's, all, it's, all, it's basically already done. Oh, what? No! Ah, uh, fine. One more. Nice. Done. Easy peasy. Man, Sabrina was way more... Way, way tougher than this. Uh, I can understand why people face Koga before Sabrina now. The Soul Badge, yay! 4,257 non-inflating currency units. Excellent. Defense. Oh, cool, nice. Defense decrease. Plays my strategy. I can use Surf outside the battle. Take this too. What is this? What does TMO6 do? Toxic, whoa! It's a secret technique over 400 years old. Uh, I don't recall Toxic being that potent or strong. If anyone in the comments, on, be, before I look it up, because I, I am allowed to look up moves in the Pokelosophy method. But if anyone knows, uh, please let me know. I would like to know if Toxic is a worthwhile investment. I should probably get to the Poke Center. Uh, thanks for everyone for joining. This was a great little quick battle. We're the halfway point of the game. And in a symbolic way, I think this is fitting because like, I'm in the safari zone in my life right now. And I'm about to enter the safari zone on a regular basis, trying to get through it. I remember it being a difficult and annoying thing. And I remember the guidebook being quite helpful. And please do not give me any tips until I ask for it. Uh, I want to make this as a personal struggle, as symbolic what I'm going through in my life right now. So with that being said, take care, everyone. Uh, leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you already haven't. And I'll try to post more wherever I can. Uh, like I said, we're all going through our struggles right now. And I do want to build a better audience with, with Pokelosophy. I love this channel. I love the community that I that we've built together here. And uh, I hope you stick around for Pokemon Red and go to Pokemon Blue, maybe even Gold. I don't know. I haven't decided the order. I'm planning on doing Pokemon Gold after Red. Uh, I never played Gold, Silver, or Crystal. So it'll be interesting to walk or not walk explore those games uh, as someone who's never played those games. But anyways, 
Take care, everyone. Uh, good luck with everything that uh, you're trying to deal with, and I'll talk to you soon.